I'm Marcy, and this is a big chicken house with all our chickens. I could name you a lot of the breeds. Rhode Island Red, Red Rock. I think those are Barb Rocks. They could be speckled Sussexes. They look just about the same. That is our Olive Egger mom. She started wanting to leave, so we just took care of her chicks for her and we let her go. She was a really good mom. <coughs> she's actually pretty friendly. She lets you get near her. She's a good chicken. <coughs> and over there in the crowd of row down red hens, you can see Roadrunner. The small the small one. Oh look at this. They're picking them. Oh yeah. Did snow I off my boots. Did I forget to tell you that they love eating snow? <laughs> so turn into winter and your feet are covered in snow. Oh look, there are roosters fighting. They look really funny when they have long necks. Oh and then one leaves and the fight's over. There are a lot of roosters in here. Yeah, we need them to keep our eggs fertilized, so mm. we had to take okay. That little chick is Pepper. Oh, that's Pepper. Uh, an olive egger, and so you know, chickens are addicted to apples. Whoa. <laughs> you just threw a piece of apple in there. They love it. Do you have some more? I, I did buy our hands off this. I think she's an Australian breed. Okay. We'll do that. Hmm. You might not see because you're looking at her back. But she has a brown chest. Okay. You might not see it on the camera, but she has very small brown stripes on her feathers. Yeah, I can All kind of see it. All those wing feathers would look really cool in your collection if you had one. Mm-hmm. The pretty bird. What's this rooster that's looking at us there? That one. What is he? He's a red rock. He's an old red but that one over there is red rock. That one's a red rock? Okay, and what's this one called? That is an olive egger. How do you spell uh, An olive egger? The color olive and egg -er. Olive egger. Oh, so he, the, the hens lay green egg. eggs. Yeah. All right, so what's this one's name? I just call it poof mane because she has really big poofy cheeks and the poofs go down to her chest. It kind of makes a big wiggly mane. Mm. So poof mane is what you call her. Yeah, when she's in the nesting box and having her eggs laid and then she just sits there. So this is an olive egg or hen? Yes. All right. <laughs> they lay green eggs. Very pretty. And we have some different ones. They got they it's kind of got smarter because we were always pulling them out by the tail, like I said. Pulling and them out of the nest box. Yeah, okay. by the tail, like I said. Not really cruel or anything. And, but the chickens that got smarter, they just sit in the nest, all fine. But once you get start getting to their, their tail, because that's where you pull them out. That's when they start pecking you because they oh, know what's happening now. Okay. Or you're reaching into here. You're gonna take my eggs. Okay. You're pulling me out. Not okay. And they just peck you and peck you and peck you until you leave them alone. Hmm. Do you get their eggs then, or do you just leave them? We don't leave them. Hmm. I just use my quickness to get it. Just reach out my hand, mm -hmm. get ready, and just yeah. get them out like that. Oh. I barely okay. even see it coming because either they don't see it coming or don't have fast enough reactions because it takes a little bit for the chicken to process that you're stealing their eggs and pulling mm. them out. Mm. Okay. But once they do, they usually peck you. Oh, okay. Some, not all, not all the hands peck you, right? Just some of them. Yeah. Very like good. That, like that poof mane lady over there. Poof mane likes to peck you. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. What am I looking at? Okay, um, go ahead. Peanut. That's and peanut. He's gobbling out away at some sort of bug. 
Yeah. Now, Peanut was one of your little chicks that you had in the summertime, right? Yeah, Pansy. Okay. Well, it was a very good mom, but unfortunately, all chicks had to suffer one consequence from their mom. Yeah. Every now and then, when she starts scratching for bugs, they all come running because they think she found a bug, and then she just scratches them. She just flings them away. Oh, she flings the chicks away. Because yeah. they get too close to her. Yeah, and as she's scratching, she flings her chick away like it's a piece of dirt. It <laughs> goes, beep, and then it recovers and runs back to its mom. Okay.